Driving is getting more expensive. Not only the fuel for our vehicles is going up, but also the roads themselves are taking their toll, literally. It's been a month since we have had to start paying to travel through two local tunnels, the downtown and the midtown tunnels. Stand on your side, Stephanie Harris is here to show us if many of you are changing the way you drive. Steph? Well, Tom, we wanted to see the numbers for the midtown and downtown tunnel traffic. Two weeks ago, Ted on your side reported that traffic was down 11% at the midtown and up 31% at the Gilmerton Bridge. Now the drivers are settling in. We wanted to know, are people staying away? Or have they gone back to their old habits? Tolls are now, for some, an unavoidable reality. I think it's rotten. For Richard Capen, more like a recurring nightmare. Very frankly, I've outlived them one time. Now we get them stuck with it, stuck with it again. The 84-year-old florist works in Portsmouth and lives in Norfolk. It's digging into my grocery money. That's what it's doing. His boss is also feeling the pinch. Along with gasoline and everything else, just adds to the expense of everyday life, which we're really stretched at. We asked Charlie Etheridge if he's spending more or less than he budgeted for since the toll started February 1st. He hasn't done the books for the month yet, but he's already adjusted deliveries. Only one trip through the tunnel a day during off-peak hours. But if the trucks are late coming back in around 4 or 5 o'clock, then that's prime time, so that adds up. Not everyone's complaining, though. And I got to say, it's been a joy ride. This man actually changed his driving pattern to go through the tunnel. It was just too much to go over the Twin Bridges anymore. Uh, but I do enjoy coming through the tunnels. Traffic is, is null compared to what it used to be before the tolls. To James Moore, time is more important. But for those like Capen, for whom the alternative is too far, there really is no choice. Just another thing you've, you've, we've got to put up with for a while until somebody takes a hatchet to it. But what are the majority of drivers doing? We asked Elizabeth River Tunnels for those numbers. A spokesperson told us since the month does not end until 11.59 tonight, they won't crunch the numbers until next week. So we will be asking again. Stay tuned for that. Stephanie Harris, 10 on your side.